All right, I should be back. I hope I'm back. Oh my god, my chair is so squeaky. I need to oil this thing or something. Am I back? Am I alive? Am I alive? Let's see here. Give me one second to update my stream. A small issue. The sound's still coming on my speakers even though I switched to my headphones. What the hell? Wait a second. Alright, then I guess I'll just restart the entire game then, Steam. Thank you for being a bit of a burden. Sorry about that. I don't know what that was. That's never happened before. I need to move my mic closer, don't I? There we go. Hopefully you can hear me just fine. I see you gather before. Geralt and Yennefer were reunited. But something even more important happened in Vizima. Geralt learned that Cirilla, his one-time ward, had returned from afar. And she was in danger. He All right, take your time, Uranus. The Emperor's command and Yennefer's behest. All right, there we go. Now it's working. My audio's a little fucked up, though. Why? That's a little weird. Ooh, motion blur. Don't like that. Oh god, I'm still in this clown outfit. Oh god, I forgot that that's where I stopped. Already knew you, directly out of Nordling materials. You could see them. Ambassador Varatra, Yennefer suggested I ask you about current events, the war and so on. Of course. The Emperor's servants should keep no secrets from each other. If you will, let us approach the map. Um. How's the war going? I mean, apart from the fact that Nilfgaard's triumph is imminent. I assume this to be a private conversation. We've no witnesses, so let's dispense with the propaganda, even that shrouded in irony. Our offensive was going splendidly until winter came. Edern was in such disarray that we encountered no resistance. We had reached the Pontar before the first snows. Only a weakened Kedwin remained, and Radovid's Redania, which had ignored the rest of the North's pleas for help. We thought they'd sue for peace, perhaps even submit to vassalization. We waited for spring, certain of victory. Radovid? Submit? Yes, a vain hope, I agree. Radovid sent no peace envoy, nor did he advance on our positions. Instead, he trudged over the snow-bound Kestrel Mountains and attacked Kedwin, his ally. This attack took the Kedweni by surprise. They were still mourning the loss of their king. Rudderless and dejected, they laid down their arms after a few lost skirmishes. 
and joined Radovid. And so by spring, instead of two weak enemies, we had only one powerful one. Jesus. What about Kavir? Kavir values its neutrality. Enough not to lend its armies, or more importantly, even its coin to either side. Returning to the war, this spring there was a massive battle in the marshes of Velen. Massive, Welcome back. yet indecisive. Both sides suffered enormous losses. Unprecedented, even. Radovid has retreated across the Pontar. He's safe for now. Until reinforcements arrive from the south. Then... Emperor Amir Var Emrys will deal with him once and for all. Couldn't you just go home? Save everyone a lot of marching, not to mention a few human lives. I'm afraid the stakes are too high to fold now. We can only go all in. It is. It's, it feels like Skyrim and Fallout put together, but it was made by a different company altogether. And what's interesting is this game when it came out had absolutely no advertisement for it put out the company did no advertisement other than t telling people that they were going to release it and the game did so well that it just exploded in popularity without a single bit of advertisement and i thought that was the coolest thing hmm. how do things look in velen as bad as ever, perhaps worse. This land never flowed with milk and honey, and now it flows with blood. Armies have swept through it several times, trampling fields, looting granaries, burning villages. Famine grips the populace. Mm -hmm. So how's ruling that earthly paradise going for you? Not well, to be honest. Our forces are spread thin as it is. And Velen is chiefly swampy forests that are difficult to control. We've had several patrols never return to their camps. Thus, we've temporarily delegated authority in this region to a certain Nordling. A former low-ranking officer in the Temerian army, one Philip Strenger. Better known by his nom de guerre, the Bloody Baron. I advise you well, avoid him. Oh god. Okay, two more to go. Any news from Novigrad? Is the free city still free? Yes. Although everyone knows this won't last. Radovid is in Oxenford, and the Emperor is here, in Vizima, at Novigrad's doorstep, both. And both require coin and ships. Novigrad can provide these. Which is why the mood in the city is... rather... well, on edge. Meaning? How do men deal with fear? They seek reassurance. And scapegoats. The Church of the Eternal Fire understands this perfectly. And so it promises to improve the lives of its flock by pointing out the guilty. Who started the war? Who profits from it? Why, it's obvious. Mages, elves, dwarves, in a word, any and all deviants. I've been stationed in Novigrad for 13 years. First as a consul, then as ambassador. I've seen a great deal. Cruelty, cynicism, greed. But what is happening there now concerns me greatly. God, this, this map is huge. I didn't realize I'm going to have this much to explore. What's new in Skellige? Nothing. The islanders pride themselves on that, don't they? Doing everything according to tradition, as their forefathers did. And like their forefathers, they quarrel with each other, pillage, occasionally attack our transports. This is cumbersome, but nothing more. Skellige has always been a footnote to history, and so it shall remain. Sound awfully confident. What if King Bran manages to unite the Jarls? Lead all the clans against your fleet? King Bran is a feeble old man. From what I know, he barely remembers the names of his own vassals. Uniting all might prove difficult. All right. Thanks for your help. Think nothing of it. May the great sun light your path. God, I just want to get out of this clown outfit. Put me in some real clothes. 
fucking made me wear this just to come in here. Can I, like, steal any food? Nope, nothing. How might I serve the gentleman? By returning my things. Citrus and cloves. The fragrance will keep the gentleman's robes fresh somewhat longer. Mm. Thanks, Bunches. The Emperor is not known for his patience. He wants his daughter back safe and sound, as soon as possible. Yeah, mention something of the sort. So long. Oh my god, please, let me have my clothes back on. Uh, I can't do that here, really? Ugh. So what's this? Is this a quest here? Wow, you look weird, lady. Oh, wait, 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 this is the Gwent game. Wait a second. Wouldn't mind a few rounds of cards. Shit, I accidentally started the card game. They got hundreds of books, but no food. Yeah, that sounds right. Shit, I messed up. I didn't mean to start up a card game. I thought that was actually a quest I could do. Now my turn? Uh Okay. I don't remember what any of these do. Okay, okay, I got it. Um how am I gonna do this? Uh, let's just put out weak leagues first. What do you got, buddy? Put a catapult. Mm. Mm, I don't know what I'm doing. Take your time, Uranus. Oh, got an archer. Well, shit, I just fucked myself, didn't I? Nah, 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 I, I ruined that one. Alright, let's start with you. What is that level 10? What is that level 10? Oh, I'm not going to win that. I don't know what to do with that. Shit, now I lost. Nope. Uh. Well, I didn't do anything for me. No, I can't win this. Jesus Christ, no, I'm good. I'm good, I've lost, there's no way. I, I gotcha. I wish I knew how to draw more cards. Like this guy is drawing a shit ton of cards. 
Yeah, I'm gonna forfeit because I, I didn't lost that. Wait, what? Oh, okay, here we go, here we go. Uh, where the hell am I supposed to go? Suggest level 35, level 1, level 5, level 10. Level 16. I guess I'm going here. Geralt and Yennefer were reunited, but something even more important happened in Vizima. Geralt learned that Cirilla, his one-time ward, had returned from afar, and she was in danger. He was to find her at the Emperor's command and Yennefer's behest. I have no freaking idea what's going on in this game. Oh wow, that's actually pretty beautiful. Holy shit. Oh god. I don't like this place. Let's let's just leave. They hung a skeleton. Oh my god, stop stop sending me all these things. Alright. How do I use my sword while on these dogs? Oh wait, <laughs> Yeah! Okay, that's not gonna work as well as I thought it would. Alright, that's definitely not working. Wait a second. Wait, I don't remember how to use the fucking abilities. God damn it! God damn it! I'm just getting my ass kicked here. Wait a second. Wait a second. Ah. Fucking. Holy shit! Oh my god! I just got here and I'm already getting beat up. Back my room is so hot. Oh, I'm sorry. It is horrible outside where I live. It got to 105 a couple days ago. It was awful. And my horse is gone. God damn it. Roach. Come back here, Roach. That's it, Roach. Wait, no, no, stop getting the sword out. I'm trying to remember how to jump. Okay, B is to jump. Alright, that's all I need to know. B is to jump. Put the sword away, my goodness. Where am 
I going exactly? Oh my gosh. Jump over the fence, Roach. Duh! A stranger! Saw him over there! Strangers coming! Run for your lives! Slow now. Whoa. Give me up. What the fuck is going on around here? I see something. Oh, it's here. Here we go. Oh, God. I can get these? My true born brother, Michael, is missing. Anyone who finds him or at least finds what his fate has met will be rewarded. Okay, I can do that. Missing wife. My wife is missing. A few days ago, she went to the woods and has returned. Okay. Watch what you say. The trees have ears. These are all warnings. Jesus. Roach, move. I think... I think they're quest too, but I'm not sure. Looking for a man. Goes by Hendrik. What do you want with him? Want to talk to him. What about? Give me a bottle of something strong. You gotta go. I'll open the back way for you. Haven't finished my drink yet. In Cape, vodka. Who's this? Uh... Brave warrior looks like. Got two swords, see? Who the hell are these Oi, guys? Great boy. What's the point of having two swords? Wonder if he keeps an extra prick in his trousers, too. You fucking deaf. Gonna say who you are? Or do I need to loosen your tongue with me knife? I'm a witcher. Heard you wondering about my swords. Well, one's for monsters, the other for humans. Only got one prick, though, in case you're wondering about that, too. <laughs> Don't even look at him. Worse than lepers, that lot. Saw one in action once. Killed a half dozen. Blood everywhere. Freak didn't even show a drop of sweat. Got the stench of corpses on him. If you want to rest, come with me. On the bench you can use. What a bunch of fucking cowards. And there's the bumpkin with what looks like his son. That's on the pretty side, I think, of himself. I say probably destroyed. Thanks for not starting a row with those swine. I don't generally poke my nose in other people's business. Looking to stay the night? No. Huh. I'm looking for Hendrik. Man lives in Heatherton. Don't know where that is. Other side of the hill. Looked that away this morning and saw a strange glow. Imperials on the raid, perhaps. But who knows? Anything else you can tell me about Hendrik? Odd fellow. Arrived from who knows where and for no apparent reason. Shacked up with a widow whose husband was stabbed for a scrap of bread. Jesus. These men don't like strangers. Aye, he stays out of their way. Always seems to know when they're coming. Always manages to disappear. Thanks, Inkeep. All right. Well, okay. Got that information. Why am I why am I trying to find this guy again? I don't remember what I was doing. Oh wait, I'm trying to find a girl. That's right. I'm trying to find a girl. Uh, what the hell is Roach? Oh, no, it's not Roach. Roach! See you later, Uranus. Sorry I didn't immediately answer.
Hey, Dolly! I didn't even know you were here! I haven't seen you speak a single sentence this entire time! I honestly had no idea you were here, Dolly. I'm so sorry. Are you at work right now, Dolly? Air is strange, like dropping into a deep cellar on a hot day, and the mist. Whoa there, Roach. What the hell's going on here? Dogs. bad this what no I just died oh fuck no I hope there's autosave That's the first time I've died on this game. I'm trying to get good at the uh, counterattack, and I just can't. Oh lord, how far back am I? Okay, I'm not that strange, far. Like dropping into a deep cellar on a hot day, in the mist. All right, let's try it again. Whoever you is, get away. Calm down, it's over. Aye, it's over. All's past, never to be restored. I'll not forget that ever. Looking for a man named Hendrik, supposed to live in this village. Aye, he did. No longer. They nabbed him in that hut. If you'd have heard the cries, sir. If you'd have heard how a man can scream. How he can suffer. Tell me what happened here, step by step. They took him. Took him all. The sun was waning, see, and the dusk went crimson like blood. Thought to myself, strange, the toads, I cannot hear them. Oh shit. I know not what happened there. 
save terror through and through. Hendrik screamed. Then he begged. By the end, he could do naught but moan. Just wonderful. Weren't here long, the terrors. Yet the village froze like in the heart of winter. You in that hut when they rode off? No. And I'll not set foot there. Never. Farewell, and peace of mind to you. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. There's like ice on this house still. Tortured him. Maybe they missed something. Maybe hid something in his jerkin. Damn, he's cold as ice. Nothing here. Need to check his pockets. Trousers are stiff, as if hung out to dry midwinter. Should check his boots. Blood, congealed. Key hidden in his boot. Gotta fit a keyhole. Somewhere nearby, hopefully. Jesus Christ. Good fucking God. for a keyhole oh I see I see how do I there's a draft gotta be a space under this rubble guess I should do some cleaning Missing Tamra Strength or Daughter of the Bloody Baron. Presumed kidnapped. Party reward. Well, that's that's uh that's good. Hmm. Interesting. What else is in here? Ooh, I found money. What am I looking for, though? I don't know what I should be... Oh, what's this? A ledger. Payment for a sack of grain. Amount due for a charcoal shipment. Hendrik was masquerading as a merchant. Hmm, what's this? Notes among the ledger entries. Clever. Interesting headings. Missing and wanted. Subject appeared in Skellige. Also sighted in Novigrad. Appearance unchanged. Ashen hair, scar on her face. Avoids contact with others. Drunken swine. So-called Baron hosted subject at his castle. Or should I say, illegally appropriated fort. Reason unknown. 
Talk to Baron at Crow's Perch. Clashed with a witch. Subject landed in swamp. Encountered a witch. Conflict ensued. Cause unknown. Find the witch. Talk to the peasantry. Village of Midcops. Caution advised. I'm being observed. Don't know by whom or why. Unsettling signs. Dog ran off. Water in bucket froze solid. Strange glow observed in the sky. Ill omen, peasants say. Somehow they learned Hendrik was looking for Ciri. Thus the torture. I'm too late. My only leads, the Baron and some witch. Damn. Oh, fuck. Oh, hell, what do I do now? Hey, Roach. Come on, boy, girl. I don't know what you are, actually. We gotta figure out where we're gonna go now. Run, Roach. Try this. Oh, how long are you gonna make me wait? <laughs> what the hell's hitting me? Deserter. Fuck this guy who's fucking shooting arrows at me. Let's end this. Hey, bitch. Fuck you for constantly shooting motherfucking arrows at me, bitch! Alright, you're gonna be my practice, bitch. Thank you. Small blackjack. Well, I don't know how much items, how many items I can take, or hold at once. Well, I am glad for, for the uh, extra combat. Because yeah, I really need the practice. Roach! There you are. This horse has the best name. Go, what's this? Glorious is full. All right.
Find the Baron. Hey, do you sell food? I need food. Just put a cider for you, or a bit of dry curd. Me lad, it's not exactly burst him, but what I got, sure to please. Uh, sure, what you got? I'd like to take a look. All right, can I, what can I sell him? For three gold? That's all you're gonna give me for these? I don't know what these are. that what does it say this guy has read additional info it's 43 gold god damn since it starts a quest though I just kind of want some food you got cheap food god this guy just does not have anything does he this is 25 gold I can buy that You got like water? Nah? And you fucking suck, buddy. Farewell. Uh, how do I? Well, I found a better sword. That's cool, I suppose. Halt! Okay, I halted. Baron home. Depends who's asking. A witcher. Want to talk to him? Well, yeah, and I want to plow the lovely Queen Seru. Seen this man before. In at the crossroads. You was there not so long ago. Thought you were supposed to go your separate way. Nice and all. It led me here. Gotta talk to the Baron. Oh, aye. What about? Something important. His ears only. Fine. Lodrin, let him in. If he makes any trouble, well, we outnumbered him. Open the gate. Sergeants. Ardle. Witcher to see the Baron. Don't want no disturbances. That clear. What do you think? Big as a house it is. Nothing here for you. Guard called you a sergeant. You a Temerian soldier? Not your concern, mate. Deserter. Tamerian army don't exist no more. So what are you all doing here? Had a choice after the Black Ones thrashed us. Let it lie and try to lead normal lives. Or continue to resist, join the guerrillas and fight for our beloved Tamaria till death do us part. We chose the former. And the Baron your commander? Hmm. Yeah. Command. Nothing here for you. Okay, everyone in this game is just so rude. Infosema, now those were balls. Attended a few, me and my Annie. How oh, how we danced, how we twirled. <laughs> oh, 
One, two, three. One, two, three. <laughs> hey! Enough. I don't care how you do it, but the deliveries must be weekly. Won't you stay for tea? No. Besides, you've another guest. Look at that. Didn't even stay for tea. In spite of all that blabbering about how cultured the nation is. Rumors rarely find confirmation in reality, especially the ones about foreigners. <laughs> right you are. I'm... I know who you are. Believe I also know why you've come. We'll talk inside. I'll stay for tea. I mean, I hate tea, but I'll stay for it. Make yourself at home. Hey, where to put the bloody vodka? Ah, there it is. A snifter. Why not? Ha, a man after my own heart. Hmm. With Foltes dead and Natalis whereabouts unknown. Bloody hell. Who's a loyal Sumerian to drink to these days? Himself and his company? Good enough. To the matter at hand, I'm Philip Stranger. Now the blob tits round here call me the bloody Baron. Geralt of Rivia. Blob tits call me the Butcher of Blaviken. I said already, I know who you are. Truth be told, it's the only reason we're talking. How do you like it here in Velen? Ah. Uh. Lovely place. Swamps, bogs, marshes everywhere. Exactly. Someone loses their way around here, he becomes damn hard to find. What are you getting at? Many have lost loved ones here. Some their wives, others their daughters. What's that supposed to mean? That a threat? Oi, not as clever as I suspected you'd be. No, it's no threat. I'll spell it out for you. I know who you're looking for. She showed up some time ago. Exhausted, wounded, and stinking like a soaked hound after a hard hunt. Later, I learned she'd come from the swamp. Said some beasts from the woods attacked her before she could reach the village. How did you not see that step? Oh god, I'm playing as her? She can. You can come down. Hello there. Are you lost? A little, I guess. Are you? Yes. 
though also just a little. Does that mean you know which way to go? Not quite. Not yet. But I'm sure we'll find the way if we set off together. What happened to you? This? It's nothing. How did you wind up here? My father brought me. Told me to follow the trail of treats and eat my fill. He said he would wait. So I started down the trail. Then I saw a butterfly. And I ran to catch it. And I lost my way. You and your father. When did you leave home? This morning. And did the sun warm your face or your back? It warmed my back. So we must go east. Come. I'll walk you home. And explain to your parents that they must not lose their children in the woods. We can't go home because of the Wolf King and his pack. No kings among wolves. These have one. And you've seen him? Yes. I mean, no. From behind a tree. He was huge, with giant eyes and great fangs, and he was terribly, disgustably horrific. See what I've got on my back? Wolves fearing. Kings do too. Come, I'll help you up. Okay, I'm gonna stick to dodging, I guess, because I am horrible at this comeback thing. I guess this dog just does not care that I killed all his friends. Can come out now. My, you're brave. My father can even do that. <laughs> Mine could do a lot more. Come. All right, kid. Where are we going? Look. There's something there. Whoa. Wait here. Don't come any closer. But no buts. Stay here. We must see something. Jesus, what happened to him? Mm. Bloodshot, but still moist. He died recently. Lips parted and bloated. Bit clear through his tongue. Immense pain before death. Ah, his chest is crushed. Ribs probably pierced his lungs. Something picked him up and threw him against the tree. Mm. Something tore his leg off. No, gnawed it off. Stay there, and look away. Hmm, what's this? Marrow's missing. Interesting. Let's see. Oh, his liver's gone. Why are you digging through his belly? Would you mind making certain your laces are tight? The Wolf King's no fantasy, it seems. Except, he's a werewolf. What happened to him? He... had a fall. Mm, I bet. 
the Wolf King got him. <laughs> when do children get so smart? What will we do when the Wolf King finds us? Good question. I've no silver, but I can make a blade oil. Oil? You mean like we make from rapeseed? No. A far more special oil. Of dog tallow, wolf's bane, fool's parsley, and wolf's liver. The Wolf King will feel terrible, terrible pain. You're smart. How do you know these things? Did your father teach you? Not my father. My uncle. Uncle Vesemir. Okay, so I need to find these items. Okay, I got the wolf's bane. Kind of. Uh. Stop trying to bite me from behind, you fucking dog. God damn it. Settlement nearby. Good, if a human settlement, maybe they can help me. Ah, okay. Do parents often send their children out to follow the sweets? Sometimes they send their children, sometimes they go themselves. Do they return? No. Why would they? They've plenty to eat where the path ends. Oh, I got you. They sent her kid out to die. They are trying to get rid of her. All right, I have everything. Now for a spot where I can build a fire and brew the oil in peace. Doing? Greasing my blade. There. You'll see just how effective Uncle Vesemir's formulae are. There's no way I did that so quickly. Am I just following this kid? I guess so. Kid? Come on, kid. You damn brat. Oh, I don't want to go through a cave. It's a bit dark. Afraid? Are you? No. Then I'm not either. Well, that didn't sound good. <laughs> what? The Wolf King, now do you believe me? I do. Hide! Oh no, 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 no. You're huge. Ah! 
Okay, I can't parry, okay, apparently. Come on, die, you fucking dog! Holy shit! Why, you really give him a drubbing. Never seen anything like it. Girl, you can come out now. Come on. You're lucky we came this way. Found someone far less fortunate in the forest. Baron, must be. We was returning from Midcops when the brute attacked. I managed to flee, but Yaren the The little one. No details. You have bandages at home? Some spirit? He laid a claw or two on me, unfortunately. I've I've not missed, but my lord, he's a powerful man. Be sure to help you. Might even reward you for cutting the werewolf down. Very well. Lead us to your lord. God, she is just stuffing her face. Just who do you think you brought me, man? That's not my daughter. And the little one? Neither, damn it. I think I'd know my own child. Well, it uh, might, might not be yours, the older one, but you've got to admit the likeness. That's downright striking. So, any chance for that reward? You'll not see one fucking copper. Get out before I set my hands on you. Oh, he lost his daughter in the woods. So, stew any good? Very. Thank you. I'd not eaten in. Clear to see. I'm pleased you like it. Had them prepare a bath for you once you've eaten. And you could do with some sleep. Gretka in the nook behind the hearth. You in the guest room opposite the kitchen. Thank you. I... Shh. Eat now. We'll speak once you've rested. God, he is a really kind man. So I ordered my men to watch her and left her to rest. And? Ah, a topic for another time. I want, I need to find her. Understand? I need every last bit of information available. I understand. But you see, it so happens my wife and daughter are missing as well. I propose an exchange. Find my loved ones, and I shall tell you about the girl you seek. All I know. Hmm... Fine. I'll help you. I'll find your family. But then you'll give me every bit of information you have. You have my word. Oh, God, God his teeth. This man's under my protection. No one's to bother him in any way. Don't stare. I've not grown horns. Treat it as a token of my good faith. When do you see them last? They vanished after the new moon. As if whisked away by shadows. What do you mean, vanished? Precisely that. I awoke one morn to find them gone. Can't start searching till I know what they look like. Tamara, my daughter, turned 19 in the spring. Slender lass, about yay tall, comes up to my shoulders. Beautiful eyes, green like her mother's. My wife, Anna, has two score winters behind her that she'd never admit it. Dark hair, thick as tar, keeps it tied up in a bun. You try to search for them? Sent men out right away. 
but they're not suited to it. It's one thing to rip up floorboards in search of a peasant's last sack of grain. Finding a living person, they just don't know how. Besides, Velen's naught but swamps and marshy woodland. Plenty of hey, hard to find nooks. If you're looking to hide someone, this is the place. I'll need to know a lot more than that. Can I see their rooms? What for? I need clues. Anything to latch on to. I'll not let a stranger pour through their belongings. Want me to find them or not? I do. Then let me work. <sighs> Fine. But I shall go with you. The doors are locked. When she was a babe, my daughter loved animals. Saw a deer trophy on a wall once. Do you know what she asked? Haven't got a clue. Papa, is that deer's wump oh, on the I other side of the wall? <laughs> you see it there? <laughs> What's a trophy? <laughs> I pity any bastard who's hurt her. I'll fly in the line. Here what are is. you doing, buddy? Damn it! Jammed again. Our bed chamber. Tomorrow's what room is there. This? Oh. Try not to make a mess. What the fuck but is that door? I want everything to be as they left it. Okay, you tell me you don't loot do anything. Okay. Wooden candlestick. Stems broken. Okay, what's this? Walls a different color. Something used to hang here. Hmm. That painting? Right size. Alright, what's this? The Baron and his wife. Hm. Look happy enough. Mm. Uh oh, my phone's going off. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Oh no. What's this? Huh. Gotta wonder who wanted to hide the hole. And what's on the other side? Emmett, I'm streaming. Hi, I love you. I'm streaming though. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Everybody, hold on. Okay, Emmett, what'd you say? I thought we were going to go out together to do that. No, it's fine. I've been streaming since you left, Emmett. I just come home. I love you. Bye right, bye. Oh my god. I'm sorry about that. Emmett decided to call me. Oh, that's adorable. Emma's this that's so adorable having Blueky's music. It's interesting. Piece of wood looks like the stem of that candlestick. No coincidence there. Hmm. Fight might have happened here. I'll look for clues. Fresh flowers. He expects them to return any minute. Takes hope. Whoa! Deep nicks. Hit with a heavy object. Those are claw marks. At least it looks like it. I really don't want to loot this guy's house because he did say... Oh, what's this? Huh. Rest of the candlestick. And wine stains. Somebody smashed a bottle. From Toussaint. Yeah. Erveloos. Scent hasn't died. Wonder where it'll lead me. Rubble. Rubble everywhere. What the hell? Damn. Trail breaks off. Could find something else, though. Hmm. Spruce wood. Smells of juniper incense. Some sort of folk talisman. Protective. Question is, 
Against what? Won't find much else here. One fucked up face. Well, excuse you! Jesus, I'm just listening to the dialogue and he goes, oh wow, what a fucked up face. Oh, fuck me. Oh wait, do I have to do this other part of the quest first? Okay. I need a good plow. Done poking around. Found signs of a fight in the room. Know anything about that? A fight? What are you talking about? Someone was attacked. Probably your wife or daughter. Whoever it was tried to defend themselves with a candlestick. Missed the attacker. Punctured the wall instead. They tussled too. I... I don't know nothing about this. That night, I was drunk. Don't remember a thing. They were gone by the time I awoke. Doubt you were the only ones in the castle. Maybe one of your men heard something? Three times I asked those bastards if they'd seen anything, heard anything. Nothing! Not a one of them! Whole landing smells of wine. Tell me anything about that? One of the lads must be. Lush is one and all. Give your men air valuse? Oh, damn it. I might have spilled it. I told you I was good and marinated that night. Was it matter? Stench of wine in plenty of corn around the castle. Recognize this amulet? Hmm. Yes. Anna began wearing it a time ago. Any idea where she got it? None. Any witches or cunning women in the area? A pella. Old Coot lives near Blackbow. And there's a cunning woman in Midcops, but I know little about her. She's only recently arrived. If Anna were to see someone, she'd choose the Pella, not the woman. Anna was wary of strangers, newcomers. Wanna have a chat with this Pella? Fair warning, he's a hard man to talk to. Rumor has it he killed his own father with an axe as a lad, then went batty. Now they say he sees ghosts and plows his goat. I'm not really interested in his hobbies. Just want to ask about the amulet. <laughs> not interested in his hobbies. <laughs> I love this guy. He's so casual, yet yeah, he lays out the most fantastic lines. <laughs> Alright, where's this pillar at? Pillar, I mean, not pillar. Find the Peller's hut. Pillar's out his shine. Don't object to your white mug. Um, I need my horse. Ouch! Come here. You slept in today, Dolly? I think everyone slept in today. Faster. I don't really want to help you. I want to just find that. Maybe when I go back. Where is this guy? 
we'll get Aha. Come on now. Quiet, Emmett. Shush. What do you want? Want to talk to the Peller? Too late. We've got dibs on a chat with him. A long one. What do you want from him? To give him what he deserves. And that is? He done conjured Algaris. Said something evil had made its nest in Edric's bowels. Told Edric to eat rowan berries. Lots of them. Ever since Edric's lived in the outhouse. And he's got hardened pustules all over him. Just so happens I need the Peller alive. So if you agree to leave him alone, for good, I'm willing to tell you how to help Edric. Hmm. Well, all in all, yes or no? Fine. Let's hear it. A tea of mullein leaves for his belly, and cover his boils with mallow. A few days and he'll be good as new. Noted. But if it don't work, we'll be back. Move out, boys. Why is everyone such an asshole in this game? Mm. Gotta wonder about a man who could get Edric's friends all worked up. Hey, anybody home? Open up, it's safe now. Devils, who do they bring? What seek ye? I need your help. Whoa, a man, nay, a wolf, grey, though not old. Tis he the Peller awaits. Why does he have chicken feet all over his shirt? You were expecting me. Aye, as the bones declared I should. They shall come whose stench is rape and death, but the wolf shall disperse them, the white wolf. And thus he comes. Omens never lie. Recognize this? Made of spruce wood, strong smell of juniper, designed to protect someone. Freshly cut spruce, sprinkled with goat's blood, then tempered with an incense of earth, smoke, and juniper. For Anna, to protect her. You make the amulet? Aye, sure it was the Pella. After the way of his forefathers, over still water in the light of a full moon. Proper as amulets go. It protected well. Should never have taken it off. So, designed to protect her. From what? Oh, the dear. Besieged she was. Evil all around, wanting to possess her. Old magic, born of oblivion. From dark sources emerged. Old magic? Can you be more specific? It is not for mouth speech, nor for the touch. A small protective charm. Not a thing more a Pella could do. Anna and her daughter are missing. Know where they are? Nay, no, nay. Pella don't know. But the spirits could know. The Pella will augur, the spirits ask. Spirits? Great. Fine with me. Long as I know where to look, where to find them. Lost, lost, must be found. Princess! None better than princess for finding things. Princess? Which princess? Princess, my goat! She's fled! Those men must have scared her off. Can we get back to the auguring? Without the goat? Impossible. No goat? <laughs> Won't work. Do I refuse to chase down some goat? Uh, I don't really want to go find your goat, buddy. Ugh. Will you help me if I bring the goat back? Princess! Princess! Where have you got to, girl? Fine. I'll get your goat. The bell! The little bell's ringing! She loves it! Ring, ring, and she will follow. But for a while. But beware of wild strawberries. Raspberries, too. 
Yeah, treacherous as beasts go. I always keep an eye out for them. <laughs> I love this guy. This guy is just the cockiest of comebacks. Okay, everybody. I have to stop for right now. Uh, how do I... Oh, God. How do I save? Oh, how do I save? Uh... Alright, here it goes. Alright, guys. I have to go. I'm sorry. Uh, this one's Tuesday. Okay, here we go. There you go. I'm sorry, guys. I'll be back later tonight, but I've been streaming since 12 o'clock, I think. So about five hours or so. So yeah, I need to take a small break and I gotta go help Elliot. So I'll be back tonight. Goodbye, everybody. Thank you all for coming. It was really awesome to have you all here. I had a I had a lot of people here today. It was pretty awesome having so many people here. And I'm going to continue tonight. I'm most likely going to go back to Stardew Valley tonight cuz I'm having a lot of fun in that game. But for right now, I got to go. I promise I'll announce in the Discord when I get back on. Bye guys.